Hey there guys, what's going on? It's the Cartoon Kitty here, and welcome back to Star vs. the Forces of Evil. We're here today with uh, Demonicism and Sophomore Slump, which um, the first one implies that Tom is going to be involved in it, just because he's literally a demon. Um, so I guess we're not going off of the last episode where Eclipse is having a trial, or maybe we are, who knows. Um, but if we're not, then this episode definitely has to do with Tom, somehow. Now... I don't know what else to expect from this, so I guess we'll just watch it? This is probably the shortest intro I'm ever going to be recorded, so, uh, cool. Either way, if you want to help support the series, you can do so down through the links below. Um, watch it on iTunes and on the Disney XD app. Help support Darren and her series. Let's go ahead and get this episode started. From another woohoo! Yeah! Make that two times now, this recording session, that I've nearly broken my headphones. Oh my gosh. Yeah, he's so much like a dog. I really love this outfit of hers. It's like my favorite of all her outfits. Oh, you know, that is so funny that you would think that Santa is such a dog because I most definitely did not run into Tom and definitely he did not tell me to not tell you what's going on. Oh my gosh. And she can't hold it in. Oh, what? <laughs> oh yeah, you're all trash. <laughs> all right then. Yeah, I tried that. What kind of dummy do you think I am? This mirror's garbage. I'm sorry. That's disappointing. Can oh, I it no, it extracts no, all their no. evilness. Thank you for choosing reflection. What? Have a mirrific day. No. We just want a map. You garbage turd. <laughs> <laughs> It's like he's trapped in his own mind type of thing. <laughs> oh, that's slow printing. Oh my gosh. It's like cult levels of creepy. What is going on? Tom. Yeah, well, I've already made up my mind, and you're not gonna stop me. Yeah, this is the only reason they wouldn't make a good couple. I didn't invite you anyway, so. Great! Great! Draw! Of course! It's just, just a disassembled head, and it's so funny. Ugh. Wow. You don't even know what you're doing, do you? This doesn't bode well. <laughs> oh my gosh. Tom, you don't do you realize that this is bad? Wow. Magic manacles. You didn't think this was serious, did you? Or do you? Oh. That has got to be magic in there. Oh dear. 
This can't be good. Oh, jeez. Boy. Star's gonna be the only one who can stop him. Oh jeez. You're just gonna leave him up there like that? Really fine. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Magical What? Wait, I thought you were a demon, though. No, 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 no. You've still got thousands of these little guys inside. We're gonna have to start you on a 13-year plan. What? Yeah, this is all gonna be a long and painful process for all of us. But you were such a good boy today, you can help yourself to just one toy from that toy chest. Oh my gosh. No, no, no. I'm gonna be an evil demon forever. The important thing is that you want to improve yourself. You can still do that with a bunch of those little guys inside of you. True. True. You better make that one toy count. Oh, so for that, that was too technically. Yeah, that'd be cool. <gasps> you two have got to be kidding me. Aww. <laughs> uh, oh, and we're back with Marco finally. Oh my gosh. <laughs> hey there, big guy. Hey, mama. Ready for the new school year. Mm. Yep. Still getting used to Earth life, though. Hmm. Yeah. He looks like a burrito. Look, I'm sure everybody on Mooney wore a cape. Mooney. It's pronounced Mooney. Marco. And I'm just trying to help you properly say Mooney. Croissant. Croissant. It's pronounced croissant. Croissant. With their accent, it is. Croissant girl. I earned this cape, and by golly, I'm gonna wear it. Good for you, Michael. The cape looks cool. Thanks, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's great. Dungeons and Dragons! What's in our surroundings? Nothing. I try and break the chains. DMC your hands. <laughs> <laughs> it's nice to see these two again, though. I just realized we haven't seen them. Marco! Oh, um, use the butter. What? There's no butter. Can you hear what she just said? There's nothing in our surroundings. Put it on the chains. Slide your hands out. Hide in the vents. It isn't Muni, Marco. <laughs> that does work. Oh boy. It works. You're free. Oh, oh. Um. Next, we go find Ludo. Say the whispering spell. Oh jeez. Destroy Toffee. Oh. No, this isn't Muni. Yeah, you destroy Toffee, save Muni. Congratulations. Jan is so totally has got to like him. It's okay, Ferguson. It's just a game. No, on Muni, this actually happened. They made me a knight. Okay, we get it. Oh, oh, look at it. Look at it now. Oh, wow. We're cave bros now, dude. Oh, that's that's great. <laughs> Marco, you're making a face. What face? This face? It's just my face. Hey, hey, hey. No secrets. We're cave bros now. Nope. Oh, well, mm. it's no big deal, but I. <laughs> <laughs> Life is unfair. Get used to it. <sighs> oh. Sensei. Uh, I mean. Did I really earn my red belt? Uh, or my green belt? Oh my gosh. I didn't earn any belts. Uh, <laughs> you know, I expected this from my mother and my probation officer. <laughs> what? What? Why do you have a probation officer? First, Ferguson and Alfonso were weird. And then Sensei was weird. Oh, Jackie's house. <sighs> I, I love Jackie. Say this, but it's like my best friends are jealous of all that I've accomplished. <laughs> I'm not trying to make you feel bad, but you haven't even asked about my summer. You've just been talking about yours. Oof. Oh, no. I'm the croissant girl. What? <laughs> oh, Jackie, I'm so sorry. Wh what are you talking about? <laughs> Jackie, gonna make this up to you. Make what up? <laughs> You're never gonna hear me say croissant again. <laughs> Jackie's like, what just happened? Oh, my gosh. <laughs> 
Wait, what's with the hair? <clears throat> Jackie Lynn Thomas. No. Here to take you on the ultimate date. Wait, seriously? Aww, they're cute. Date? No cake. I'm back. I'm yeah, I bet it's tucked away inside the hoodie. Can you guess what I want to do right now? Oh, Jackie, you know I'm no good at this game. Three months. <laughs> uh, okay. Do you want to go to Seashellville? Shelltown. Shellville? Necklace land. <laughs> Necklace land. Shells? <laughs> Marco, the beach. Seashell land? <sighs> Shelly. Mike and Shelly. Mike and Shelly's house. Aww. Dude, we're here. Oh, the pier. Oh, the pier, okay. I, I, never got that. I couldn't remember if they lived by so beach or not. We still haven't figured out the money thing. What? Yeah, these things are rigged, don't you know? This thing is rigged. Let me try. Uh, oh. I like how she's using it as a pl as a the plush as a. Aww. No, I can't eat him. He looks so sad. We can fix that. Hey, what do you think you are doing? Freedom! <laughs> 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 Probably should have taken the clips off first. Didn't say goodbye. Not even a little claw wave or something, dude. <laughs> oh, glad they had a nice day together. Lobsters. We saved one, but we could have saved them all. You want to go back for him? I kind of do, though. <laughs> Jackie is best girl. Yeah. No. <laughs> uh. It's a great thing. Oh. No place I'd rather be. Yeah, no, you have the cape underneath. Huh. What? How did that get in? <laughs> Let's talk. Uh oh. Okay, I know this looks bad, but I'm fine. I can take it off anytime I want. Look, today was awesome. You don't. It's really sweet that you're trying. Are you going to? You're forcing yourself to stay in Echo Creek just so I'll be happy. Then we'll both end up miserable. You do see that, right? So I figure now's a good time to give you an out. I want to make this work. You're my best friend, Jackie. Ooh. Oh, Marco. We both know that's not true. Did did she just break up with him? You never sent a kid to another dimension before. Sure you have. It's just like what Star did when she did her exchange program. Just, you know, in the opposite direction. Well, I hope I'm not sending you off to your death. Marco, hold on, you can't leave yet! We want to say sorry for how he acted the other day. No, guys. I'm the one who needs to say sorry. I I really haven't been around much and dude, it's okay. Look, we we brought you something. It's our lucky die. It'll grant you good fortune on your travels. Oh, that's oh, nice of them. You guys. For the record, I'm still mad at you. <laughs> I know, but I got you something. Ooh. I'm gonna miss you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna miss you, <laughs> Well, I guess this is. Okay, so he is gonna go to Muni. I don't understand. We're just letting Marco leave school. Is this even legal? <laughs> Shh. Marco needs to have his own French summer. What? What is happening? <laughs> Right there with you. Yeah, I'm I'm him. Literally like what is going on? How do you know that they're gonna even like Star's pretty much probably dating Tom by now, so how do you Just when just when we think that the whole Jackie thing is gonna work out, she essentially breaks up with him that, that's sad like they were doing a good job and I I know why she's she's she knows he like she knows she knows about star she knows that Marco's mind is over on Muni that their relationship could never be normal in that case 
That's just sad. That's sad. I, I really like Jackie. Like this doesn't change that I don't that I like her. She's still a good girl. Um, I thought what would happen is if they did end up having them break up, it's because Jackie was only in it for, you know, so I'll date you for the fun of it type things, but I'm not really interested in you. I thought that that's how they were gonna go. So it's nice to see that's not the case um, and kind of sad as well for Jackie because, you know, that's gotta hurt to be, you know, you're dating someone and then they call you their best friend. That's like, I think Marco unintentionally friend zoned her that moment and then she's like okay yeah that's it's 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 for sure the relationship between us right now would not work out that's sad i really like jackie yeah and i'm gonna miss seeing her they were so cute in that episode too so does this mean see this is when the relationship thing starts getting weird if star starts dating tom again and marco finds out is marco gonna try to find another girl I still don't know if that's what Darren's going for, but if Starco is the end game, then it feels weird to be going through so many relationships. I know that it's totally natural in the real world to date multiple people, but I, I, I hope that it's dealt with correctly. I hope it's not just, oh, get with this person, break up with them, get up with this person, break up with them, and now the two people who everyone wanted to date are all are together now after, like, all these relationships. Between Marco and Jackie, I knew that Jackie was going to be the one to break up with Marco. I knew it wasn't going to be the other way around. Jackie is still best girl, in my opinion. She, she's great. I love her. So I guess the demon, demoncism is the same thing as an exorcism, where you... It, the whole thing is where you get a demon expelled from you, but this one, it's... See, I, I got confused, because I thought Tom was actually the demon. I didn't know that there were... he was... I know he's the prince of the underworld and stuff, but I thought he was an actual demon. His mom is literally a demon, so I don't know. That's 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 weird. A little little weird, but I mean, hey, it it, it worked, I, I guess, kind of, sort of. I don't know. Uh, it's it's kind of actually funny that Marco is going to Muni to live when no one knows it yet. Like I don't even think he let the king queen know ahead of time. So or maybe he did. But Star most definitely will not know, so that's gonna be interesting. I have a feeling she's gonna be hanging out with Tom when Marco first sees her. That's gonna be some more drama right there. Yeah, so that was this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, let me know. Leave a like down below. Let me know what you think in the comments. Follow me on my social media for updates on upcoming videos. Check me out on my Patreon. And as always, guys, I'll see you in the next video that we do around here. Peace, guys!